Hello guys, how are you doing today? Welcome, welcome. So, uh, so got a few things that, that I would like to be doing today and, and that actually includes some of these quests. Uh, some of these dungeons are actually quite cool. Now this is, I don't think the right time to go into dungeons. It's like, um, what time is it over? It's server time is actually two. That's interesting. It's a standard time. Whatever. Anyway, what I would like to do is unlock this one. The Legacy of Halang. Valach. Uh, which is uh, basically the, the trial. Uh, or the trial, the raids. Uh, you'll get three raids. All of these I'll actually have to do. The ultimate ballot is Ultima. On, I think, is, is it hard or extreme? Uh, I actually don't know. And some of these as well, like the, the Wrath, uh, Enter the Sunken Temple. Uh, which is actually, I think this is a more funny one than the other one. Which is fine, definitely Pirates. I think I did do that, yeah. I, I did do this um, in a roulette. Yeah. So yeah, I didn't really think about that. Mm -hmm. uh, but I still want to do my dailies and stuff. Uh, that's why I've been uh, trying to get some accessory going. Got a cool ass cat, man. Was dropped in the FC bank. Ooh, don't know why people want to drop that into a bank. Use it. It is so cute. Anyways, I've been working on my accessory. As you can see, they're all 130 now. Next up, by definition, is going to be uh, the stiletto. And that reminds me. Uh, what do we have in the Chocobo Saddlebag? 45, huh? I am never going to remember that, so I'm just going to be using that. Other than that, uh, let's just get the Glamour in there. Clean up a tiny bit of my accessory. Eventually what I'll do is like I will start uh, swapping in like these level 1, Savage Aims, Material 1. Um, with the NPC in... What is it? Talalan? Somewhere in Talalan, I think. Uh, I thought it would be... In here. No, don't want to go there. Yeah, here. This one. The Materia Master. You can switch in 5 for uh, 1. Right? Yeah. So that is one of the things that uh, that I would like to be doing. Other than that, laying the foundation. I kind of want to go and, you know, do all of that. And this will actually bring me to uh, Reverend Tall, which is a Mordona. And if we arrive there, I think it would be the most wise thing to go and do the raid. Or at least unlocking it, because there is a bit of a, uh, a story thing going on with that. Love the frog hat over there. I know, I'm extremely random. I also made uh, macros. They just don't work as good as I hoped. And I don't know why, I'll show them over here. My hutton, which is just Jin Shi Ten, uh, so Jin Shi Ten. And we got the Suton, which is Ten Chi Jin. And we have Doton, which is the AI, which is Ten Jin Shi. Now, because of the macros, I can actually start to memorize them. So we're going to be bringing them back over here. I'll just keep them over there. Uh, morning, because the macros are sadly super slow. Well, it kind of, it, it, it actually, it, 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 yeah, not really. I'll show you this one. Uh, one, two, three. So we have a delay here. Wait for 0.06. We can bring that all the way down. Let's say we do shoot on. Let's take a look. If we can just squeeze it up to like 0.3. Uh, one, no, it's too fast. Okay, too fast. Uh, 0.4. Oh, that's, that's not a 4. Also, how are you doing, Ida? Hopefully you're having a good day. One. No, too fast. Okay, 0.5. I've, I know it works with 0.5, so half a second. 
Um, doing fine, you guess. Well, good to hear that you're doing fine. One. Okay, maybe it is absolutely atrocious. Maybe there's a reason I put it at like 0.6. One. Oh, it's because of bunny ears. I've not had it given in much time. No? They're all at 0 0.6. What are you talking about? Well, whatever. Uh, we're not using them anyways. Um, manual input is just a lot faster. That's all I'm saying. No, you're right. You are right. But my memory. My memory sometimes is absolutely horrible. Also, this person, is, his memory is worse than mine. He forgot to take, put on his clothes. Uh, this morning. So let's go to Minfilia and we'll start hopefully to move towards Reventol. And then we'll do the raiding stuff and hopefully soon uh, we'll do the additional dungeons. We have actually unlocked a few. I believe one of them is in here, the airport. The other one, I think, is in Mordona. So let's go here right now. And it would be the hard dungeon to... Uh, I don't know, actually. Um, the hard dungeon. Let's talk. Battle with the Siren. Uh, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Or is this... Yeah, why so serious? Wait, is this a delivery? No. It's not. Here we go. So it is true that you triumphed over the siren. Words cannot express my gratitude. My only gr regret is that my dear brother could not be there. Not be here today to hear that our father's death has been avenged. He set sail with his crew three years past, you see. And has yet to return to shore. But I hold hope that his ship shall... Come sailing into harbor any day now. Oh my god, you poor, poor. And on that day I shall be the first to share with him the news of your triumph. My dear, your brother is dead. In the meanwhile, however, we can finally press on the restoration of Parasirius. I must get to work at once. I would be much in your debt if you could inform the master that the coast is clear for us to begin. Actually, this is a... Is this a turn-in quest? It could be. Could very well be. Uh, we've been trying also to unlock uh, the a second submarine with the workshop. And we've been trying to do the sea, deep sea side free. Uh, the RNG gods are currently against us. So yeah, that's it's kind of sad. Kind of sad. Ah, uh, you've done it. Send the bloody siren stretching and shrieking to the mocky depths. What she came. Uh, you've done us all a great service today, lass. If you wouldn't mind. Uh, regale old Midewa's ears with a tale of the foul wrench last song. Please don't. What's that? You had to fend off a ghostly crew wearing sea sodden dots of Maelstrom Man. You see? Yeah. <clears throat> it says I feared the poor lass. My heart goes out to her. It was three years to the day, given or take a moon. A crew of the Maelstrom's finest set sail on a routine patrol, but it ain't nothing routine in these parts. And they did not return to shore. Rumors spread quickly that it was a siren song that led the vessel to a watery grave. So, see, it's not only her father, but it's only her, also her brother, dying to the siren. Maelstrom Command jumped to quiet, uh, 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 jumped to quiet to talk. Ill tidings were already too e uh, easy to come by in those days after the calamity, but those of us in the know, we knew, like father, like son, less, promise this old sod you'll spare, uh, you'll spare poor 
Dienda the truth. Less already suffered more than a share. You think it's better for her than not knowing that her brother... Well, guess that sorted. This, this cannot be. My brother is still alive at sea. The search effort continues, Master. You yourself told me the same. Forgive me, Missy. I never meant to deceive. The Maelstrom made me swear a vow, you see. That I'd keep the truth buried deep within... Ah, bugger me vow. And bugger me. The truth is, the discovery coward just could not summon the nerve to tell you the truth. Can you forgive an old sot? No. I mean, you lied to him for three years. There's no need for forgiveness, master. For the true coward is me. In my heart, I've always known. This adventurous deed and your words have finally given me the courage to face the truth. I am a woman grown. The time for clinging to childish dreams has passed. I must look to the future. My smithing skills are still wanting. We are wanting. But I will not falter from the task. Vera Cirrus will burn bright once more. A beacon of hope in the darkest of nights. A fell song of the sea. Uh, the fell song of the sea have claimed their last victim. I shall see to it with my own two hands. I know what's up with the eye color, man. That's so weird. Strong words, lads. I trust you haven't you you will not forget them when your your paws are still blabby and blistery. Okay, I guess. My hands, why? I clench my hammer with my teeth. If I need be. Father, brother, do you hear me? Your death will not be in vain. Oh well, you know. Okay, do her. So we did actually complete the quest. I thought we would get a new one over here, but I've, I guess both of them are going to be in Mordona. And we have the cookie munch over there. Hello. Hi there. How are you doing? Uh, is there anything else I want to do here? Not really, no. I, I was... I actually, I've been doing the reputation stuff. As you can see, like 90, 30, 30, 30. But by God, it takes forever. It is quite a chore. To do all of them. You get like 10 points per mission. You get 3 missions. Uh, to do with all of the beast stripes a day. And then eventually you'll hit like the 150. You'll go to the second level. And I think you'll get another 3 missions. I don't know if you could do 6 missions then. So you could go and like get like 60 points a day. Or if it is still 3 missions. And, and I know you... Um... You can get some cool items from them. I I think I got some moonstone, but I don't know where I put them right now. Uh, you could just that the new missions give more rep per mission while the old one still the current amount. Okay, so it's actually better just to keep doing like the level twos and just just see what's going on. It can definitely be better, but I'm okay. But you are uh, doing good. Currently, Sremen. Okay, we'll go to Minfilia. Uh, I don't know where the other one is. Let's also unpack this uh, weapon coffer. It will be daggers, which will be weaker than the ones I'm having right now. You know, it's fine. They're also like white and not, not greenish or anything. Well, they're definitely not blue. So, yeah, they're not as good. Let's go there. And we'll see. We'll see what's going on. Is there anything over here? No. Okay, let's go. Let's run. So let's take a look. If I want to Doten. Yeah. If I want to do the speed thing. 
And if I wanted to do the other thing, it's like that. I'm starting to actually remember that. Uh, high, st high stream is actually being sad over there. I don't know if you can see it. It's Cookie Muncha. It says name changed since last time. Um, luckily. And let's take a look. So we actually do have Ifrit uh, bleeds. We can if uh, Ifrit bleeds, we can kill it, which is the hard dungeon for the uh, the Ifrit quest. And after which we'll you'll unlock uh, Titan and then Garuda, and then you can actually get the the extreme dungeon. So you'll get like Garuda, Titan, and then Ifrit, uh, which could be problematic. But they will give you uh, mounts, which are actually quite fun. I like that. Do you ever wonder how he does it, Alfinot? I mean, it was almost predictable that he should appear with uh, with an emissary of the Adventurous Guild here moments after I had expressed the need to forge ties between our organizations. Truly, he senses of uh, his sense of timing rivals even your own. Setting uh, setting such mysteries aside for the present, I have a task for you. I would like you to deliver these documents to Staffborn. Uh, they concern our forthcoming move. Do take care on the road uh, and represent us well. You know, why are you why are you not going? Why do I have to go? Maybe I don't want to. Maybe I'm busy. Uh, okay, so Cookie Muncha as well as Helen says hi. Hi, stream. So, oh, and hi, YouTube later as well. So there is actually a keepsake over there. There's two. Oh, here we go. Uh, not easy being green. And for keepsake. And these are probably the two hard dungeons of... Uh, let's take a look here. Uh, the Lost City. And... There was another one. Is it Hallbreaker Island? I don't... I'm not... Could also be Umber Keep. I think it is Umber Keep. But then again... It's just me, so I don't know. There you go, Slavborn. I was told to expect a sign, but I did, I did not expect it to be you. It has been far too long, Une. Have you so you have something for me? Yes. Yeah, of course. You already know I have a letter with me. Why did it send me? Let's see now. Yes. Everything appears to be in order. You'll be staying with us for a while, yes? Would that... Uh, would that we have a dozen more like you? Since... We don't, though uh, we'll just give you the work of a dozen men. <laughs> oh, I like that. So aiming is going to be like for assess, and I, I don't need any of these. And it is highly unlikely I will ever need them in advance. And this is a choker, so... You can't really see it because my gear is hiding it. But yeah, uh, if I didn't have that on, yeah, it's still a choker. It's just just a choker. Like, I I'm not that deep into it. It's possibly a primal. I like that, and we get a I level seventy weapon coffer that is level fifty. So that is definitely going to be an increase of the stilettos, and we'll also get a buffalo calf. And we'll get the money, which is just a hundred kill. It's such, oh man, it's so low, it's so low. Back, uh, back to do the work of a dozen men. I see, ha! Huh? But I jest. Even I can um, appreciate that an important woman such as yourselves has little time for menial tasks. But since you are here, may I? You'd be keen on having a look around the son's new home. See that impressive structure over there? That is the place. That is indeed an impressive structure. It was originally built to house a branch of the guild, you see. As such, 
It comes complete with a tavern where adventurers can rest off the road, fill their bellies with good food and drink, and their ears with tales of fortunes to be had about the realm. It may get a bit rousious at times, but I imagine it will be a good place as any to recruit capable men and women to your cause. Come with me, I'll show you around. You don't have to walk me through. Tataru. Okay, is that you, Ne? I'm quite sorry to interrupt, but I have urgent news. We've received grim tidings from G G Gradania and it would appear our aid is required at once. I must ask you to report back to the walking sand with all due haste. Is everything quite alright, friend? Oh, it just got... someone was calling me, I'm sorry. I can't say I'm privy to the details. But it would appear this is not a time for a leisurely... It's leisurely tour. But no worries, we can, uh, you can rest assured that you'll see all of the necessary arrangements. Pray return any time after you have seen to your more pressing matters. I was here for like 3 seconds. 3 seconds, all that it took. Uh, do we get the two missions or shall we just get this over with? I think I want to get this over with. Uh, let us go to the Walking Sand. And we'll go over these unique helmets. In some of the dungeons you'll get like a unique helmets, uh, armor and, and stuff like that. Which uh, you can actually turn in for um, some of that blue level 50. Is it level 50? Or is it level 45 one? So it's, it, it's not the 130 iron works like. But it is the uh, the other one. The, uh, the i90 I think. Oh here's that the room. A messenger from the Twin Adder came to the Walking Sands while you were in Mordona. He wasn't privy to the conversation. I wasn't privy to the conversation with your dissident, but I did see the look on her face after he took his leave. Something is definitely amiss. Could it be that the Exile have summoned Garuda again? Or mayhap Imperial forces have been sighting within the Shroud? Well, whatever it may be, I'm absolutely certain it's nothing you can't handle. Now go and ask your dissident if there's anything you can do. That's actually why I was here. Okay, Minfilia, give me the good news. I knew this day would come, yet I prayed it would not come so soon. We have reason to believe that another primal, or an, enti or an entity resembling one, has been summoned in Gridania. Oh, it's my favorite character. Thine arrival is customarily timely, you know? The Ifric waves leave little room for doubt. Thy talents will be needed ere long. If there be truth in my suspicions, it's a familiar foe we face, though one quite unlike the Lady of the Vortex. We dare not draw conclusions without evidence, but as Uranger says, the readings bear a strong resemblance to once observed more than five years ago, though I had hoped the Mughal guards beyond such follies. Wait, is this? Are we going to do the Mughal king? Suffice it to say, this disturbance warrants a full investigation. Thy presence had been requested by Commander Hellux. He awaited thee at the Atlas Nest. Pray hasten to Gra uh, Gradana, Ude, Ida, and Papa Lima will rendezvous with you there. May you walk with the light of the crystal. Alright. Ah, I will do it. Uh, that's fine. Uh, let us just click mission. Black Shroud. 
teleport over there. It's gonna be good. It's gonna be good. Oh, it's so busy. Uh, Atlas is over there. Let's run. I liked him more when he was flying around. The fear of... Uh, uh, and Odin in the shroud. That's one. And he also has something. It will just never end. A pleasure to see you as always, you know. Thank you for answering my summons. Quite frankly, I could think of no one more qualified to... Ah, but we're getting ahead of ourselves. Allow me to explain. Horny. Alright, let's get the weapon. Uh, we already have a good weapon on our warrior and on our white mage. And this is... This is interesting. Uh, item comparison, what's wrong? We'll get more decks. Uh, vitality, direct hit rate is definitely high, and skill speed. So it is an improvement. Uh, but it's... It's... it's Slim. Even the auto attack is less. It's a cleaver. Really now. Okay. Holy crap. Wait, wait, wait. wait. Damn. Uh, uh, that, that, it could work, I guess. Uh, who am I to judge? Who am I to judge? You. All hail, the, all hail to the king. Yeah, it is actually him. Cool. Not long ago, a Mughal Kuplo uh, Kop visit the Atlas Nest to request an audience with the Elder Seeds here. He spoke of an imminent threat to all Mughal kind. One which would imperil the entire 12th wood, if left unchecked. You proved an able ambassador to the Sylphs, and, would, uh, we, and we would have you represent the role in our dealings with the Mughals. The rest you should hear from the from Kuplo Kop himself. He awaits you with the Elder Seeds at the Lotus Stand. Uh, which I think is... Honestly, I don't know. But I'm thinking it's going to be right over there. Yeah, it is. Okay. Uh, okay. Silent Conjurer. Yeah, let's uh, show me in. Let's go. That's actually quite a nice area. Especially during the, the light, like daylight and all. Okay, uh, please, you have to stop them, but you mustn't kill them. They're not bad Mughals, Kupo. They just misguided. A gentle, no, firm trashing is in order, yes. But no, calm yourself, Kupo Cop. Kuplo Cop. Can you not see that C hasn't the finest, the finest, I, uh, yeah, faintest idea what you're talking about? Be quiet this instant. Pray forgive his witless outburst, sister. Most grateful am I that you have come, Une, and such, uh, and upon such short notice. Truly, Gridania could not wish for a more stalwart ally. But you are doubtless eager to know wherefore we summoned you. Our friend Kuplo Kop has brought us, new has brought us news of a most untestling development. Unsettling. That's un not untesting. Unsettling. It would seem that good King Mughal Mog the Twelfth has returned to Eorzea. A curious thing to her, I kn to hear I know. Truth to tell, I myself cannot say for sure if he is gen if he is a genuine figure from history or some manifestation of Mughal mythology. Kuplo here would have me believe the former. 
Once upon a time, we Moogles served the gods in the heavens. It was quite nice up there, unspeakably beautiful, unimaginably spacious, and with a literal endless supply of wine, Kipo. So you are alcoholics, how nice. In spite of this, or possibly because of the last part, the gods eventually became discontent and started squabbling, which made life's joy difficult for poor Muggles. So, good King Moogle Morg the Twelfth, may his glorious name live forever, decreed that the time had come to leave. The realm of man would suffice, he said, so all the Moogles should live there instead. Unfortunately, the two realms are so far apart that we could not safely fly down. But good King Moogle Morg the Twelfth, may his miraculous foresight ever been praised, knew exactly what to do, Kipo. He had a rope, you see, the longest one I ever woven. This he nobly held while his subjects climbed all the way down to the world below. And that is how we Moogles came to this land, Kipo. All of us except good King Moogle Mog Twelve. May his courage, uh, courageous sacrifice never be forgotten. He alone would remain in the heavens so that Moogle kind might at last know peace. Except that he was not remained in the heavens, from what I understand, that being your reason of contacting us, yes? I'll bet he tied the rope to something. Good thinking. Remind me again what the problem was with him returning to Eosia. The problem, Ida, lies in the fact that he was summoned. It is our belief that Guk Good King Mughal Mog 12 is a myth made manifestation via means akin to those employed by the beast tribes in summoning their gods. Wait, you're saying a beautiful, uh, a handful of Mughals with a buttload, a boatload of crystal wished really, really hard and he just sort of appeared. Would that even work? What I cannot fathom is why they would even try. With Garuda hum uh, humbled and the Ultima weapon destroyed, what, uh, what a new threat! Uh, what a what new threat could have prompted them to take so drastic measures? Well, I I'd say it could be Ultima weapon. Might not in itself be the answer. Twice in the in the last half decade, Eorzea have brought uh, onto the very brink of destruction, only to be spared at the hand, or, or, or only to be spared at the last by the heroics of a chosen few. To you, who brave those tempts best and survive by virtue of your own strength. This last period of peace will doubtlessly seem a welcome respite, but to those who had not the power to defend themselves, who were spared only by another's grace, this is merely a calm before the storm. Yeah, it, it's, it's, it, it, precisely that. I think the Mughal guards are afraid. Afraid of what tomorrow will bring, and what may, and, and what things may not end so well as they did yesterday. That fear has driven them to call upon a greater power, one they believe can be relied upon to protect their loved ones and their homes. Come, uh, and their homes comes what may. I assure you, the Mughal guard only wanted to protect the forest from outsiders. But ever since the return of the good king Mughal uh, Mok, 12th, may his boundless grace fill our hearts with love. They've started to get a little carried away, Kipo. Verge on a lot, in fact. That was a weird sentence. Like the self who summoned Ramu, you mean. 
Mm. We cannot discount the possibility that this entirely is influenced, influencing the Mughals in a matter similar to that of a primal. We share a, summon, uh, a same concern. However or whatever the king may be, it is our belief that he possesses a threat, not only to Mughal kind, but to Gradania as a whole. Thus we must beseech you to confront good King Olmuk, Mok the Twelfth, and drive him from our midst. I, I will go slay, slay a Mughal. I humbly do thank you. The sanctuary of the Mughal God and their liege lord is concealed by a magical wand. Um, the brother Esuni Yan and of the Conjurer's Guild will doubtlessly be able to offer insight on how they might be dispelled. Pray seek his counsel ere uh, you proceed any further. Okay. Go, go, let's go kill some Mughal. Why not? I'll do it. I think we still have a lot of blue quest, guys. Now, I didn't go and teleport like I usually do because the good fella is actually over here. I think I will unsummon this uh, creature. Uh, welcome, Une, welcome. That you should be the one to face good King Mughal Morg the Twelfth is of great comfort to me and to the elements both. As I am sure you know the Mughals are not by their nature a warlike race. Yet should the king be suffered to remain it is like that his influence will bring about a change to them. Uh, Thus does it behoove us to defeat him quickly, before any lasting damage is done. Make whatever preparations you deem necessary and inform me when you are ready to seek the king. The wards um, bearing access to the king's sanctuary can only be nullified through the use of a chanted keystones. The self same method employed five years ago when the f uh, when first the king was summoned to the wait he was summoned to Eorzea? It was with great regret, uh, regret that we were forced to sanction the slaying of the guardians who then held the keystones for none were in our possession at the time. By the grace of the elementals However, we have been spared that burden on this occasion. Kuplo Kop uh, confides in me that he had been entrusted with a set of keystones by the Mughal guard themselves. Yet, wishing not to betray their confidence, he begged me to find some other means to gain entry to the king's center. Ah, that's not going to happen. Alas, I have been unable to do so, and dare not labor any longer, for fear that the Mughals might succumb to the corrupted influence of their liege lord. We must needs have Kuplo Kop's keystone, you know? Pray go to him and beg his assistance. He awaits you at the West Shore Prayer. Impress upon him our great need, and I am certain he will yield. What's up, buddy? Uh, yeah, now, now we can actually use the stone. Do we also can quickly do all of the blue quests? And I say quickly, we all know that's not going to happen. Uh, basically, because this is all about, like, entering. But do we care as much? Like, report, uh, enter, because I have actually did this one. Ultimate Ballot, I did not. It's all entering and, you know, doing stuff. He's actually there with Madonna. Yeah. So, and, and actually... 
at some point you'll see all of them because I, I, I do plan on making like some sort of short videos on uh, on all of these dungeons like only the dungeons like these are like the vaults it's it's all about the stream but I want to do a new game plus and then just record and then use I think like AI voices to uh, do the entire story so you don't have to you know listen to me being weird I just have to check that out how it will go so how will you do it Kupo oh he told you about that well if there's truly no other way I'll do it Kupo take the ferry to Sweet Bloom Pier I'll go on ahead well that was so easy did not expect him to be that easy. Yeah, let's go. Damn, these guys are large. Don't you dare lie to me, Koopo. I know what you're planning and I won't allow it. Open your eyes, Koopo. The king will never be satisfied, no matter how many crystals you bring him. Ah, uh, seriously? Cleave us up? We offered you a choice and this is how you repay us. By consorting with this aura? Imperials, Gradanians, Sylphs. You're no different from the rest of them. Actually, you're worse, Kipo. Traitor to his king's Mughals. He plots treason against the crown. Enough. Kupo Cop will answer for his crime soon enough. As well uh, as will all who defy the will of good King Mughal Morg XII. May his reign forevermore. Kipo. That's it. Alright. They were quite fun to watch actually. A lot larger than they are. The king is planning to purge the twelfth wood of his enemies, Kipo. We've got to stop him before he is too late. Before it's too late. Well I'll be damned. Let's go. The entrance to Torn March is deep within the uh, Bramble Patch. If you take me there, I can nullify the ward. But be warned, the Mughal Guard has set traps to lure enchanted beasts. I cannot hide from them, so you'll need to protect me. So we're, it's going to be an escort mission. Okay. Let's go. Is he just following me, or... Keep going. Okay. And there we go. That was easy. Do we need to follow, like, the path? Or can we just... Take this road a bit. Seems like we can. Okay, nice. Uh, yeah, completely forgot. I'll actually have to do these right now. Make sure we get some sort of aggro. And I've been rotating between uh, the three classes I get. Or have. Not a hostile presence. Man, the assassination didn't do as much. Yeah. 
quite like the cleavers actually. I might switch to the white mage just to heal him. Although I don't think it's going to be absolutely necessary. It's over there. Over there. I think it's over here. Yeah. Oh no you don't! Leave my Koopa alone! It seems like we need to be over there. I'm thinking one more attack. A good one. Maybe not. But we're here, Kupo. I don't see any more beasts, do you? Okay. Are you ready to face the King Kupo? Then step closer to the wound. Raise your hand and focus. Like you attuned to an etherite, Kippo. I'll open the way for you. Can we teleport down? That would be nice. That would probably open the dungeon. So what can we do if we wait for a party? Because this is... This is a trial, so uh, it, it might be eight. Might be eight. The rest is up to you, Cooper. Now go and teach those foolish Mughals a lesson and send the king back to whence he came. Okay, it's a hard one. So it's an eight men. Yeah, I think they're all eight. Let's check it out. Trial. Yeah, two tanks, two healers, two DPS. Uh, what do they actually need? Like, it doesn't say what they would need. We'll get 12 tomes from, which is actually quite nice. Do we just queue up as our assassin? What's, what's the current level? Like, uh, we could go as a priest, actually. It's been a while. Just a bit, a little while. Not too long a while. Let's queue up like this. Because it's so much easier going as a priest. Or a tank. Actually, so far, like, the priests have been... Faster. One of the tanks is not really responding, that's fine. I'll wait to see him. Oh man, that's so... They're adorable. It is so funny. <laughs> From a touch. Who in the seven hours are they? Meddling adventures, I wager. <laughs> Mughal guy, two arms, defend the king! Kupo. Yeah, that was very quick. Let's start with that. And go... Uh, what can I type? I... What the fuck? Why can't I go to party chat? I... There we go. Don't know why it took so long go with that. We'll keep a close eye on everything that's going on. Like, I want to make sure that... Oh, that's that's annoying. Please go away from me. Right, here we go. Get close. 
Materia 2. Start with a arrows. I don't think we have to do. We have two white mages, so we're actually double casting regen. Which is absolutely perfect. Let's do that again. I don't think we have to do a lot. Let's just keep that up. That is so good. Okay, arrows. Arrow. And stone. And then... And let's do the regen again. That's it's King Moogle time. <laughs> oh my god. And there is the king. Off with the hats. <laughs> oh man, here we go. Hey, uh, let's do material. Two. Bit of a no brainer, and then you start casting like crazy. This is, I don't think it's too difficult. Yeah, what does he do? What will he do? Okay, this is a good time to go with Materia. Hey, right, run. Stay away from me. Please. There you go. Man, two white mages so powerful. Look, look, these regens are actually quite good. And we have 300 assists. That's, that's 700 HP per, per like, tick. I love that. Hey, that uh, might go over here. And run. Run circles. Run to safety. Run for death. Hey, okay, so tank busters over there. Which is just nothing at all. Let's go with another material. Because why not? There we go. <laughs> this is such an easy fight. That was so easy. And Ida, of course, man. You are always welcome to join. There you go. That was so nice. So easy. Oh, it's kind of sad, though. Oh, that! Oh, that startle reaction. Wait, was he just? Oh, that's so, so unfair for them. They just wanted to feel protected. Thank you for a group. Great accommodation. Go with the knight. He did great. Um, what do we have over here? Majestic for a... It's greeted. We won't get it. And a pork coffer. Which I'm going to be just needing. We might not get anything. We might just get both of them. And we didn't get anything. Ah oh well. Ah oh well. That was such a nice, nice quick mission. I like that. I'm regretting also the fact that I put on the short... You did it, Kupo! You did it! Good King Mughal Morg XII, may his mighty soul rest in peace. It's no more. He's still dancing. I started to think what might have happened had you not stopped the Mughal guard when you did. Thank you, Ne. Perhaps now they'll come to their senses and stop playing at fairy tales. Rest assured that the chieftain will have. Uh, choice words for them too. You should go and tell Pugni Pak that the king is no more, Kupo. 
She'll um, she'll with Raya O at Camp Tranquil and can relay the news to the chieftain. Oh, okay, that's exactly the other half. I really like that fight. Um, it is. It is so. It's such a happy fight. Actually, I really like it. Okay, let's take a look. I'll be checking my rep. We need to get to, I think, like 1500. Yeah, we'll be going at it for a while. Let's go. Yeah. Pack, knee, pack. Do I dare believe my ears? The good king Mughal Mog 12. May his magnificent virgin ser virtue serve as an example to us all. Has fallen. All Mughal kind owe you a debt, Kupo. Ah. And I sense Raya O wishes you to congratulate you as well. I shall let you two speak without fear of fear of interruption. Okay, let's go talk with her then. Your bravery in service of the twelve foot and her Mughal shall not be forgotten forgotten, Une. My sister will doubtlessly wish to hear the tale of your great victory of the of the mouth of the woman responsible. Pray return to the Lotus Strand and treat her to a full account of the day's events. While the details are yet fresh to your mind. Well, we it's more like a dance off than a fight, if anything. I really like that fight. And I can actually repeat that quite a few times. That's so, so nice. Right, let's go. Uh, we actually will take the Etherite over to the Conjurer's Guild. Now, once we turn in that quest, we'll actually get the other blue quest. Uh, the one that is with the Twin Edders. And we'll see what happens. Uh, we just have to just pick them up. I know that you might not be interested in that, and you're solely here for the MSQ. But, you know, hey, it's all part of it. This is going to be a long journey. Une, you are returned to us, unharmed and victorious. Thus have I two reasons to be glad that... Why did they not join, actually? Oh, well. Yet many questions remain unanswered. If you would be so kind as to oblige me, I would faint hear all that occurred in Torn March. Well, we had a dance-off. Yeah, it was fun. King failed. It is as we feared. The king really is a primal. But he really isn't, is he? I mean, the Mughals don't worship him for one thing. He's not even a god to them. That doesn't sound like any primal I've heard of. Then, mayhap, the fault lies with the definition. The fact remains that though a combination of the power contained in crystals and the force of their collective faith, the Mughals called forth uh, a being that was, by rights, should not exist. Moreover, when slain, said being left no corpse, the ether which compressed him instead being scattered by the four winds. That makes a lot of sense. According to the accepted definition, he may not be a primal, but the mode of his manifestation was in every respect the same. Which means, I would just say he's a primal. Asians. This whole business reeks of their handiworks. Yeah, keep a call. Keep po po. They, they say it was a masked man who taught them how years ago. But Gridania has no shortage of masked men. And 
and I never thought to question. Confound it all! How many more uh, will they ensnare with their tainted gifts? Too many, I fear. So long as there are paragons to stir the embers, fools to build the prey, and crystals to feed the flames, Ever and again shall we suffer primal visitation. A, a somber thought, but a solitary one? This guy, I don't know why, he just creeps me out, man. My heart felt thanks, Yune. Already information you have provided has proven invaluable. The Grand Serpent Marshal and I have much to discuss. Oh, before you go, milady, I was hoping we might finish discussing that other matter. Uh, the matter of which you speak has even now been settled. The science shall not uh, sh sh shall not want for support. Wait, wait. The science shall not want for support. We shall be glad to send additional supplies to Revan Toll. I knew we could count on you, milady. So, are we just going to have three new primals with all of the, the like, the three city-states? While well, Ida and I uh, remain to discuss the particulars of our arrangement with the Elder Sitsa, perhaps you could return to the Walking Sands and apprise the Edicident of all that has transpired. Uh, we will, but first things first. Uh, we'll be getting the other blue quests over here. Walk around a bit as a gladiator, looks kind of nice. Sorry about that. I don't know if you heard it, but I was bumping my, my uh, printer. And because my desk is cramped, it's crazy. So I've started the process to... Am I going the right direction? No, I'm not. Uh, to starting to, you know, do some tech works on the, uh, the VODs. And a tiny bit of renaming them, I think. Uh, let's talk to you. What do you want? Uh, fear of Odin in the Shroud. Yeah. You know, your timing never fails to amaze, unless I'm mistaken. You have knowledge of a Elder Primal Odin, right? I do? Yes, he's, he's old. As I thought, well... As you know, we have long pursued the Dark Divinity for the pages of Arcane Scripture to the Shroud itself. Perhaps we have a plan to put his prowling to an end. Brother O. Epesi, very easy to pronounce name, has the command. He has personally requested your aid in this venture and awaits you at Alders Fond. I'm sure he will give you the details once you present yourself. Okay. Uh, quarry Mill? It's over there? Really? Did not know that. By the way, did we get tomes? We... Ah, oh, we did. Wait, no way. Can we see that? No, I can't. Ah. I probably like turned it off. It's fine. It feels like I got a few. Wait, yes, of course, it is visible. I'm an idiot. It's right over there. And um, we got 12 and then we have the first time uh, doing it. Which should actually give that as well. Did you only get 15 for beating uh, the Ultimate's Bane on... I'm going to say this is extreme. I once did this without realizing I was doing an extreme one. You know, didn't know. Don't blame me. So uh, what I will get... Um, is basically we have all of the accessories for the um, 
Is it in here? Yeah, it's in here. Uh, for the white mage as well as for our ninja, the one thing we are missing is uh, the weapon for our ninja. Uh, we already have the weapon for the white mage. So yeah, that would definitely make you know the weapon for the ninja a priority. And then we'll slowly start getting gear class by class. Yeah, I don't I don't know. I don't know about this character here. Okay. Adventurer, thank you for coming. We seek the dark divinity, and you must be made privy to the plan before the game is afoot. As you know, Odin hunts in the forest. We should banish him from the shroud. Yet, in actual fact, he has fallen before countless adventurers already. Wait, what? He has fallen before countless adventurers already? By all right, the primal should plague us no more. Did I fight him before then? I don't think so. Yet, though, again and again he has vanished, or vanquished. He arises always to charge through the Twelfth Wood. His constant reappearance is perplexing to say the least and raises two questions. Who summons him and how does he change his vestige upon manifestation? Odin is alone amongst the primals in this uh, aspect. Indeed. I can find no... no uh, I can find not a singular sentence in the scriptures that shed light on his devilish abilities. There is no answer in word written of the pen. Now, the sword must serve. Our plan is to send a band of adventurers against the Dark Trinity of Divinity. Brother I Suniyan, my master and I will observe the battle from our safety. Of course, we won't be joining. If you guys die, it's okay because we will survive. We believe seeing the moment uh, we believe seeing the moment of Odin's defeat may give us a clue, one that will lead to uncovering the truth of the primal that has escaped us thus far. Naturally, this hinges upon the company's victory. No one but a warrior of light could hope to survive the battle. Hence, I are uh, okay. So he's explaining why he's just, you know, safe in the distance. Indeed, without you, your uh, our venture is doomed to fail. So I implore you, lend us your strength, if you. Is it quit? I shall invoke the power of the elementals and draw the dark divinity to the spring. It's not a hard mode. Uh, technically counts as extreme, but it's rather a normal trial. But not a part of a daily... So... Um, you mean like the... Ultima. Ultima's Bane. Shall we just do as, as, as a white mage again? Shall we do it as a tank? Let's do it as a tank. Uh, did you want to join? Oh, hey, hello there, how are you doing? This will take a good hour to pop, or more. I can... Uh, raising your chances. Okay, cool. Even on heals. Yeah, it, it, it's a, it's 8-man, right? Again. Well, we'll see if it happens. Like, it, it's optional. We don't have to do it right now. Um, I'll just wait for Ida to log on then. Even on heels, it's an extreme. Oh, um... The... Uh, yeah, the uh, this one. Ultimate's Bane. I did it as a black mage. And I didn't have to wait for that long, actually. It's fed only from Manta Roulette. Oh...
Wait, this is an extreme. Okay. Any brain dead chicken can do it? Ah, oh, shit. You're raising the bar way too high for me. Were you coming or, or what? What the hell is that? Give me a second, I need to check my yard. Alright, that was nothing. Uh oh maybe some of the FC would join as well. Okay, Nadia's over there. Invite the party. Um let's go FC any for uh, uh to found you'll have to wait no you'll have to wait uh also have a chair if we will can we check it Get out of five, it's synced. It is synced, yes. I don't see any response, so I'm going to be queuing us up. Let's take a look. I don't think we got it then. If it's, I didn't do the bit on the house. I thought it was going to be like tomorrow. Oh wait, never mind. Um, withdraw. Helen. I'll go as a healer then. If Helen is going to do tank, I might as go. I'll go as a healer. Might just help our chances. I have one of each. Waiting time, 15 minutes. Oh, that's that's nice. That's fine. Uh, I might as well then go to uh, Mordona. Get the other blue quests. Like, if we have to wait for that, I, I'm not going to stand here idling. Um, I think it's Mordona I need to go. Go to Reverend Tor. I did do this dungeon a few times. Let's get in. I think it's this house, right? Yeah, it is. Okay, there we go. You. Ro Ro Lorina, for keep's sake. A wayfarer like yourself must be privy to all matters of tales. Yes. So tell me, what do you know of the adventurers who purged the cultist from the ruin of Amdor Keep? Uh, we did. Um. No, we didn't win. Okay, well that's that's disappointing. What? It was you who did the deed. Then you are just a person I've been seeking. There is a man I would have you lend your ear to. A hero known as Adelstan. He dwells in Camp Tranquil from where he surveys the Twelfth Wood. Of late, he has sensed dark stirrings from Amdor Keep and would speak with one, with, uh, with one who was brave, who has braved the runes already. But I shall put no words 
in uh, Brothers Edmund's mouth. Pray attend him in the southern shroud. If you give him my name as proof of your intent, he will not withhold a single detail of what he has observed. Okay. I uh, will do that. After we do this. Um... Let's go. Good day to you, my wayfaring friend. Say, you don't you wouldn't happen to be the woman who slew the Tonberry King, would you? Oh we did. I did. Tonberry blood on all my eggs. I knew it. By the onion. I I've a fine gent for you. Looking for you that is wait what I have I, I've a fine gen for you, looking for you, that is, he has a petition proposal on the table and I think you should pay him a visit. He is one, invite me beach, I'll do it after this cinematic. Uh, he is one of the treasure hunters at camp uh, Bronze Lake, oh and he will of course be there with his partner. The two are inseparable, but I'll lend, uh, let them tell you more themselves. Well, off to La Nocea with you. Uh, invite party. Cannot locate character with that name. He's probably teleporting. Cannot locate character with that name. Oh, yeah, idiot, I know. Wait, you're not online. No, you are online. Unable to, okay, we need to drop. Jesus. Did you get it? Yeah. Okay, let's queue up the dungeon again then. And... We could go over here, but we'll eventually go there ourselves. I want to go to... Camp... Drink will. Well, this is now a party finder thing. No, it's not. No worries. No worries. It will work. Uh, anything? No. Oh wait, he's actually over here, never mind. Yes, Edelston. Ah, yes, I'm Edelston. One ever listening to the Shroud, play te uh, pray tell, why have you sought me out? Uh, you are come to Lorraine's urging. Good heavens, the elementals smile upon me, sending one of the brave soul. Souls who smote the cultrist within Enbos Keep. Well met, my friend. I am here at Arun Sema's behest to investigate the keep. You are here because of my findings. Terrible things festered within those ruins and someone must destroy them. Yes, even though the lambs of Dalamund and their dealings with voids and plagues us no longer, the felt presence hangs over the place, grows stronger every day. Woodwell's ventures into the keep to find the cause. Their reports were chilling. Someone has completed the cultist rituals and summoned the most ghastly of voidsend. Over them reigns a leader, peerless uh, in might and malice. You must uh, fell this void sent lord. 
and so dispel the foundless hanging, uh, full of foulness hanging over the ruins. Maxine guards the gates of Emdor Keep. I shall alert her of your coming. Now go, my friend, and may the element guide over you. Uh, I can swap tank too. Um, yeah, that's actually a good call. Um, sure. Sure. Uh, let's get us out of duty finder. Okay. Uh, two tanks to DP. Uh, is it tank. Helen is DPS. Um, I think what we'll actually do. Kind of opt for DPS. Just, just, that is not. Just, just, we'll, um, it will be okay. Can I queue us up in? Again. Um, let me, okay, tank now, okay, um, yeah, are we, are we ready to queue? I'll really uh, tell, uh, I am. I'm always ready. Ah, uh, fine. Let's queue us up then. There you go. One tank, one DPS, well, two healers. So, yeah, that's not going to be... I could do tank as well. No, but we wouldn't have a healer. Uh, at least we wouldn't have two healers. Got a new outfit to show off. Let's talk to you. What brings you back to this tainted place, adventurer? Ah, so you are the one who answered brother's call to enter the ruins. I warn you though, the keep has never been more perilous. The evil that dwells within has warped the forest life, turning woodland animals to brutish beasts. The place is feral. Our only hope is to slay the void scent at the heart of the castle. If we do not, well, I pray that the elements guide your way through the keep adventure, and your victory brings peace to the vict uh, to the forest. There we go with its heart. And camp bronze lake. I'll go there. Talk to you. Uh, a blue zoom sent uh, send you away. You say, "Well, I'll be thrice damned." It's you, I, the heroic lady who lopped off the Tom Berry's king's hat. Do you remember us? We was the pair around the entrance to the wondrous palace. Saw you right before the great bleeding Tom Berry stabbed us. Wait, you were stabbed? Oh wait, they were at the they, were they at the beginning? That probably makes sense. Uh, here, wait, here wasn't we step with air? Here wasn't we step? Whatever. Just give me the dungeon. Indeed, we were. It was most unpleasant. Now, adventurer. You are here to do something we would prefer not to do ourselves, venturing into the Wanderer's Palace again. Best we start at the beginning, eh? Like I was saying, it was... Hacking away at little Tomberries when the big ones snuck up behind us. Well, we tried to fight it off, 
But it got the best of us. Never been in a worse shape. Just lying there, bleeding. Hells, I thought we, were, we weren't long for this realm. But just as I was thinking of my last words, lo and behold, the Tomberries we'd been having it out, which started treating us, nursing us back to health, they did. That's when we learned the truth about the tom the Tombies. See, they was only menacing folk cause of a curse, a curse that you lifted when you slew the Tomberry King. At heart, that... Loram... Calm and twice as kindly again. Why, it was a right pleasure having them take care of us, of a fair sp having having them take care of us for a fair spell. It's a pity those peaceful peaceful days didn't last. A band of Mamodja, what called themselves the Silver Scales came storming into the palace. They say they're mercenaries, but they're nothing but scum of the bleeding realm. The hoveling, the blood, the blood, and so many dead, as if they weren't enough, the surviving tombbearers were locked away deep in the ruins. Why in the name of the twelve did they deserve such a faith, I ask you? We, we have grown far fond of the Tomberries while living amongst them. They have good hearts, no matter how odd they appear. None of that should matter anyways. This fellow is Arum and I'm Boquet. We are... Are we lesser a couple of our difference? I think not. And I, I hate it when they talk weird. Hey Pleur. Hey man, yeah, I'm doing good. How about you? Uh, fortunately, we did not get the house, so they, they, they're dropping the money back into the bank. My heart goes out to the Tomberries, truly. It is uh, to be so, so betrayed, so ill-treated and locked away in some horror dungeon and by one's own people. Wait, that, uh, one owns people? My dearest and I know that they know their pain all too well we both had to leave our birthplace why ask simply because we were different no we will not sit idle by and let those turnbearers be subjected to such horrible treatment well said love but much as we'd like to give the skill scale silver skills the boot ourselves we can't stand up for a cartload of momalja so please, say you'll do it in our place. The Wondrous Palace is the only home the Tomberries have. Got it? Now, you'll have to speak with Abazi Karazi and get a ride in its boat across the lake. Eh, what's wrong? Uh, eh, what is it now? Bon voyage. College work. Co oh, I'm sorry to hear that, mate. That that's horrible. Hopefully, it won't it won't be too long today. So we're waiting for one more tank and one more DPS. Come on a treasure hunt errand, have you? Well, I'll take you across the lake, but be warned. The, pla uh, the palace you're making for is held by the silver scales. And their leader is most fearsome, is the most fearsome of the lot. Now, the Tomberries aren't friends of mine, but even I think the way the Mag Mamols, Mamolia, have them imprisoned is wrong. Capturing them, turning them into trolls, Go and give those cell swords a hell. Finally. I hate it when they talk like that. Okay, so let's turn those off. Uh, uh, actually in here, yeah. Alright, speak with him. We'll have to do. We can actually open that up. That will, that will come. Where is this? 
That is down there. We'll actually do that. Let's open that up. Enter Stone Vigil. Confront the ultimate weapon. Enter. Keepsake is also enter. Enter. And this one is also turning in. So let's open that up. And I need to get myself a Bravura. Or a Barbarian's Bardage. Um, and then Enhanced by 2 or whatever. Corpse Gloom is also entering. And we're queuing this up and it takes bloody forever. With that done, let's go to Limsa. Deliver that quest. See what we get. And I might just take a moment, like if this takes too long to, to feed the dogs. Half castle it is. Let's see what the uh, Maelstrom Command has to say about this. Denston. Good to see you back in one piece. And with Mistbeard's coffin, no less. Let's have a look at it then. The lock's still intact and there's no sign it's been tampered with. You did good, adventurer. The chief will be right pleased. Yeah, it's, it's so true. The moment I feed them, the, the, the dungeon will pop, yeah. And indeed, he is. I knew that you wouldn't disappoint me, friend. You have my gratitude. Now. Now, we're curious as the... Uh, we're, you are curious as to the content. I do not doubt. I've risked life and limb to retrieve a coffer. You have more than earned the right to that knowledge. It's empty. The coffer holds the secret to Mistbeard's identity. Ooh. Are you bloody kidding me? You're joking. Menacing, is it not? This mask, my friend, has been worn by all the individuals who has borne the name Mist. Wait, it's just a it's sort of a legendary thing then, huh? Ah, maybe it was not one man but many. For generations, both name and mask have been inherited by those deemed worthy. And so the legend continues. But now the legend will come to an end. For the last Miss Bird has found a new purpose in life. One woman and her dream. Oh, the Admiral. Of a daughter's future for Limsa Leminza. It's Mayhap. Milp? Milp. As you know... Ours is a nation founded by pirates. It is in Limsian. Uh, it is a Liminsian's blood to desire to be his own master, to reject authority and to take what he wants. Some, on, uh, some amongst us believe that piracy is a time-honored tradition, but so long as we cling to these traditions, we will never know lasting prosperity. These were the woman's words, and Mistbeer saw wisdom in them. He swore to do all in his power to make her dream a reality. In the future, see and in the future she envisioned, there is no place for pirate kings, but in the tales of fishwives. And so Mistbeer has chosen to consign himself and his predecessor to the wait. He, oh wow. Okay, I get it. This mask symbolizes an obsolete way of life. Yet it's not without power. Should it fall into the wrong hands, another misbeard will rise. Hot-blooded Lemonians of Liminsians. I have so much issues with this word. Lominsians. Will gather to his dread banner and piracy will continue. The mask will never see the light of day again. 
On this day, the pirate king, Mistbeard, draws his last breath. Denton, I trust you know what to do. He just plumps it into the ocean. Alright, Chief. Give it a bit of time. The rumors of treasures will fade, just like the mists clearing. And that's it. Mission completed. As usual, the wife steal freedom. Oh. <laughs> I... I... Don't say that to the missus. She'll have you by the nuts. Okay, so it's definitely pirates is over there. And that is the... We also have the other one to turn in. But that is in the walking sand. Oh, actually, is this the... Yeah, that's the MSQ. That's the main story. That's fine. Uh, let's get on our chocobo. Let's fly. Man, this definitely takes forever. Yeah, I... I that's, this is annoying. I might have to wait until, like... This is an American server, right? So, most of them are currently probably at work or trying to have a life. Ah, you are returned. Tell me, were you able to identify the intruders? Men who looked like jellyfish. And you say that they were Captain Madison and his crew. This is deceptively odd. Decidedly odd. But I know better than to doubt you. I will have the bodies retrieved for study. That we might be better prepared to face such enemies in the future. Your work here is done, friend. Pray make your way to Ilport. Commodore Reynolds await, awaits news there. And will doubtless be, be glad at first time the court. Okay, so I have to go back. Fine. We just not go there right away. You'll see that it, it just just in a second it will just go pop. Just just any second now. No, actually it will pop the minute I say, well, I'm going to take a few seconds and then, you know, do the thing that I want to do. This is close to This is close to prime time. What's what is prime time? It's prime time is good time, right? They're not like a lot, but there's a lot of Austro Brazilian playing around. Ah, okay, so it, it's any second now. Reina. You have interesting companions. I've already received word of your success. You do not disappoint. So our body has arrived for inspection. Seriously, this is how you arrive. It's the captain. Yeah, he was smashed, right? This this thing used to be a man. Gods be good. How did this happen? A side to turn the stomach. This well I haven't eaten. Wait, what? Who the hell are you? It's Davy Jones. My lady. Thank you for grant, uh, granting us your valuable time. And exp Wait, no. She's the researcher, right? Commodore, allow me to introduce Miss... Sienna, farmo foremost among the celebrated professors of liberty. Yeah, yes, yes, yes. Let us not stand on ceremony, friends. This man's unnatural form can be attributed, I believe, to the excess abominations of water aspect ether. A living being can only absorb a certain quantity of ether before suffering, suffering adverse effects. To be altered so dressed, uh, dr drastically requires a fatal dose. Yet your subject here lived long enough to be, to be struck down. A most peculiar case indeed. I have heard that a primal creates created troll by showing mortals which is... No, no. I heard that a primal... Creates trolls by showering mortals with its own ether. Could this be an extension of that process? I dare say you've struck the mark. Wait, is this going to like the Leviathan? 
I've been exposed once to a primal's ether. Wait, if be if being exposed once to a primal's ether is enough to corrupt the mind, it's plausible that repre repeated exposure corrupts the flesh. Madison and his crew have failed to hold Statasha for their Savagin overlords, and I suspect that this is their punishment. The fishback depravity knows no bound. To think that creatures capable of such cruelty lurk nearby, I shan't get I shan't get another wink of sleep while I'm here. Have no fear, milady. My yellow jackets are sworn to protect Illport and her residents. And in light of recent developments, you may be certain that we will redouble our vigilance. Your words give me heart, Commander. And as previously arranged upon by way of payment for my service, I shall hold on this specimen for my research. It's, oh, it's daddy time, the navel. Oh, shit. Um, okay, let's uh, let's take a look here. Yeah? Okay, all this is a bit, okay. Uh, prime time special is around 5 p.m. EDT, which is in about five hours and lasts for five, six hours. But people are awake now. We aren't just, no, I'm just doing normal things. Prime time means it's normally things are five to ten minutes wait. Well, we're closing up to a good 20. Like PvP pops, high level dungeons are going, etc. Yeah. Okay. I'm going to be jinxing it. Very much so. I'm going to be turning up my volume, but lowering my mic, and I'm going to be feeding them dogs. I don't actually know what you're unlocking. I just like saying that. Oh! I thought it was like the navel. Oh man. Okay, give me a sec. I guess it didn't pop yet. Okay, uh, let's take a look. Confront Odin, Walking Sand, and this one. I guess uh, we'll just go to the Walking Sand. I I'm not going to wait here idly, not doing anything. So let's use this. I also, and I, I completely forgot about that. I need to get myself a retainer. I don't have one yet. I, I didn't have need for one. As you can see, I still didn't fill up my inventory. Check my dog for a sec. Like, like my dog is, is one of them slots. Of actually, like, a, 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 one of them dogs that actually eats so fast he might actually choke himself. So yeah, I have to do definitely pay attention to that. Hey, walking sand. Oh, cookie muncher. Damn, he jumps freakishly high. Holy crap. Damn. <laughs> no, he isn't. He isn't. He's a sloth, or just uh, something that eats 
eats fast? No, not a slot. A sloth. Yeah. You it's different. No local set to the map thing. Uh no local set. <laughs> uh I I yeah doing. Uh, yeah, a pig. Actually, that would be a good one. Yeah, a pig. Um, streaming currently. Hey. Right, let's get in. Is that a dance? What the, f what the fuck is she doing? Oh, yeah, Lily. Yeah? No? Uh, dance. Heading quite weird. Uh, I'm stuck on ferry. Why? Why? What do you mean? Why are you stuck? You can go everywhere, right? Oh, wait, wait. Oh, you're on the server there. And you're in, in duty finder, so you can't leave. Yeah. I don't think this is going to happen, guys. You drop it, and I'll just continue the MSQ. Uh, Twitch. Alright, uh, need to check my dog again. Go shout in Limsa. I'm not good shout. Dog? Uh, so yeah. We'll see. We'll see what happens. Uh, what's the name? Oh yeah, that's a good one. Uh, daily fix. Wait, can I actually do that? While waiting? Um, we could actually talk to Uranger. That's why I'm usually... Okay, so you're world hopping to see if people join you. But the duty finder is like... It, it's it's the same, right? It's It, 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 it goes cross-service, I think. Okay, Tenshrit. What do you want, mate? Oh, we get Storm Seal. That's always nice. Confirmation has just arrived from the Immortal Flames. It is as Urin just said. I fear the Amal Ja have summoned Ifrit again. A confrontation with the Lord of Inferno is inevitable. I would like nothing more than to lend to you my blade. But the students of, of Baldastian insist that I refrain from taking to the field when it concerns Primals. I know not the working of it, but it would seem that recent events have left me especially subcurable to tempting. As much as I hate missing out on the fun, for everyone's sake I must sit this one out. Instead I will focus on gathering and analyzing data. Uh, Q define require. That is very true either. That is absolutely true. Um, now. The Immortal Flames have already conducted a preliminary investigation into Ifrit. They may well be... They may well be, have inf they may well have information that will look at that. Thank you so much. Appreciate that. Welcome. How are you doing? Have information that will be of use to us. Do pay a visit to the Hall of Flame and speak to Commander Swift. One last thing before you depart. Doubtless you remember Mintvidio's words. But this Ifrit is a far cry from the prime primal you first defeated. 
you will want to assemble your most dependable comrades for the mission. Be safe, my friend. Ha! Okay. I just might as well. Uh, if it bleeds, let's kill it. Let's go there. What do you want, mate? Go, go in. Yeah. Second dog is now eating, so that's good. Uh, with both white mages, yeah, I, I like I like maging, and I also have um, uh, warrior and and, and and of course the ninja. And we'll take some more. We're currently waiting to get one more tank and one more DPS for this Urus found. Uh, so in about an hour, we can actually do it. Uh, we've now been waiting for 30 minutes, guys. Welcome. Thank you for holding on. Uh, wish my outfit even better. I was seeing again. I actually also, speaking of glams, uh, I did do... I, I cleaned up my inventory. Why is this not queued up? Because I am an idiot. Wait, it's... You. Get those cleavers in. What are you talking about? So yeah, I got my white mage and ninja as well as a warrior. So I can get away free way. I'm actually, I'm just waiting to see what I will do. Once we get more of those, um, Allegan, Allegan tombstones, these? Allegan tombstones of poetics. Then, um, wait, resets in 111 hours? What's that? What, what's resetting? So how are you going? Uh, how are you doing, uh, goddess? Just call you goddess for convenience sake. Wait, it resets to zero. It, it, no, right? I'm, I must be. I must be just getting that. Oh, I did. Oh, oh. That resets to zero. Totally doesn't get reset. There's another thing that are weekly, even though challenge logs. Wait, are challenge... Wait, wait, wait. Challenge logs... They're weekly? Oh, yeah, of course they are. Hey, display complete. <laughs> That's a bloody amount of them. Complete five dungeons. Wait, I did do that? That's so weird. Uh, squadron missions were set like noon. Uh, speaking of squadron missions, damn, I forgot about them. Uh, I can't do that over here. Uh, let's talk to Commander Swift. Uh, week weekly starts on Tuesdays. Strange. You know, we thank you for coming. The Flame General will be hearted to hear that you have answered the call. As we have already relayed to the walking sand, Ifrit has returned. For the sake of peace in the region, we humbly request that you vanquish him. The primal is to be found in his domain, the Bowl of Ember. 
To get there you must use the Beastman Ephrite found within the depths of Zarkar, the Almaja stronghold. The Almaja have constructed their own Ethernet from salvage Eth Wow, that's really clever actually. That being the case, you should be able to use it without problem. No doubt you've already known this from your fellow signs, but the present incarnation of Ifrit is far stronger than the last. Facing him with any fewer than seven of your stoutest comrades would be ill-advised. That is all the intelligence we have to share. The rest is in your hands. I shall pray for your victory and safe return. He is actually only praying for victory. Like, my safe return does... Just... Eh. Uh, let's go to Little Alamiga. Man, that takes forever. Holy crap. Elite... And... Whoa. What? Elite? Oh, fuck's sake, man. My dog really wants to go outside. It's an extreme. Uh, okay, uh, second again. Elite Dangerous. Oh, I've never played that. Uh, Whoa, well, as most know, I've played for a week before I got permabend. Yeah, it was bad. It was a good week. It's good fun. I'm just take, uh, taking me so long. I'm so tired. Um, what MSQ mission are you doing at the moment? How? Oh, it's easy. Download the Yuga. Yeah. Uh, yeah, that was easy actually. It was so easy. Download the add on package that has all the add ons. Mind you, this is a few years ago, okay? Uh, and then um, what you do is uh, you, ex you ex just enable all of them, get confused about what the hell are you looking at, log out, and then try to log in. Works every time. Wait, I cannot go there? That's actually a good looking building. That's a very good looking building, actually. There you go. Got a screenshot. Yeah, I think so. Yeah, it, I don't know if it's right now. Like, Also, I didn't really feel like... I enjoyed the artwork. It, it is a, it is unique, like, don't get me wrong on that. Um, but I like this game visually... I think this game is visually more pleasing. That's also a good one. Uh, I think I'm right behind you in the MSQ, really? So you just finished a Realm Reborn then? Maybe. And if you ask yourself, are my streams always this messy? Yes, <laughs> they are. <laughs> they sure as hell are. That's a tune over here, otherwise it would be, you know, shame. Oh, you just do, oh, you do for Ifrit, yeah. Okay, there's the entrance now, we can now go into Ifrit hard mode. Wait, do we have, of course we have free one. 
everybody great attention again, aren't you? Uh, let's take a look. Oh yeah, nice. Okay, with that out of the way... Do we need to do anything with that then? Bowels of Ember. And uh, we'll do them at some point. Man, this... this if, if we do this... This... Uh, primal. I will not do another primal then. Because, my god, this is taking like 40 minutes. Uh, you'll be required to do hard modes in about... Yeah, true true uh, maybe but uh, I just got out of my night shifts and I kind of need to make sure I get into a morning rotation because it's Saturday I need to be out of bed at 4 a.m. Misremembering them, which is the one? Um, that's the, the the horses is the uh, the extremes for uh, the base game. Yeah, you get the um, the extreme ones. They give horses. Also, with Titan Heart, I can do PvP with a healer. Yeah, so it, it does take so long for you actually get there. Okay, let's go to. So, um, um, Goddess, is this our first playthrough of the game? Like, is this the first time you'll be playing it? Uncue from this, do Ifrit. Yeah, I, I don't want to like queue up again for something because at some point, like, I do need to like stop. This has been 41 minutes, it's a bloody joke for a tank and a DPS. I got almost to the end of Heaven World two or three years ago, but I kind got stolen. Oh shit. Oh, sorry to hear that. It will be less than five minutes. Okay, fine. Fine, we'll do that. Uh, we'll do that. Um, Bile of Embers. your blanket
I do like how he looks though. He is such a badass. Okay, so hopefully we won't die. <laughs> okay, um, let's go quickly do. Okay, not all of them got it. Damn it! I hate it when everyone is like already in a circle. Do that again. Get spell on the tank. Arrow on the boss. We have the two white mages, which is always the best. Because we don't have to heal at all anymore. All we have to do is making sure we don't die because we forget to do a thing. You've got to be kidding me. Are you kidding me? Okay, now that pin should... There we go. Okay, nice. Oh, just in the nick of time. Uh, that healer, that tank, not liking it. Alright, let's go. Materia 2. And smack that beast up. Uh, they don't have a... Uh, yeah, maybe. Maybe that is in indeed... The what the hell is that? Go back. Don't want to be the one just dying. It's a healer, healer. Oh, ain't that nice. Go away, you might get... Ah, uh, please don't die. Come on, please don't do it. Do a regen on me. Alright, arrow. And materia. Everyone huddle up. That's good. Good enough. Wait, is he dancing? What's he doing? Oh, he's an assassin. He's been throwing daggers? He's been throwing daggers? What are you doing? Don't throw daggers. Get in there, smack him up. Oh, thank you so much. We actually got it done. Player recommendation is going to be a bot. Well, that was a lot easier then. Um, the, uh, I did my smacking. Yeah, you did. Uh, current extremes are at 20? 20, 20 what? 20 minutes? Oh, 20 minutes to pop. Cool. Wait, there's loot? Forgot about the loot. So sorry. Uh, great. Uh, great. Vote on loot, please. No. <laughs> I was AFK, dude. <laughs> yeah, well, once you need it, do let me know. I'll, I'll definitely join. Okay, with that out of the way. Uh, yeah, I'm not going to do this one. No, not, 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 not going to happen right now. Uh, let's go back to the MSQ. If it's rot, let's try that on. Please, why do I always appear naked? Ooh, I like it. That looks quite nice. Is that... What the hell is that? Is that a tentacle? Is that a horn? Probably a horn. If it's horn. It will be fine, I promise. No, uh, no, 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 no. Tight, tight and hard, okay, but tight and extreme... Um, either how long were we doing? Either uh, were we doing extreme the navel? I think it was a, a nightmare in a half. Also, yeah, it's a horn. It's not a tentacle. That would be weird. Uh, 
I also want to continue the MSQ. Also, how many points did I get? 414. Also, I have to do the other one. Honestly, it took people forever to learn it. I still don't know. Like, at some point, it was absolutely frustrating. I think we spent like one and a half hours for Naval Extreme. Oh man, that was so. Okay, Papa Lim, what the hell do you want? Um. Oh, Garuda. Oh, Garuda isn't that bad. Ah, Una, I hear you have triumphed over Ifrit. Of course, this is no least uh, a feat that I would expect from the Warrior of Light. But well done, it's the same. Now, I full had my mind to crack open a bottle of the 1547 Beggars. But the celebrations must keep. Garuda, I'm afraid to say, has also returned. As you well know, Garuda's appetite for destruction far exceeds that of the other primals. Not to dishearten you, but in, in her last, latest incarnation, that appetite has become high insatiable. In the short time since her return, she's already wrecked tr uh, tremendous havoc. You must send her back. To the Aoife before she can do more damage. In the meantime, Ida and I will assist the Order of the Twin Edda in her recovery effort. When you previously faced Garuda, it was the Enterprise that bore you through the storm that shielded her domain. Well, the storm is as a spring breeze beside what she raised this time. No airship could hope to penetrate it. And so we must count ourselves fortunate that the Order of Twin Edda uh, chanced to discover a Beastman Ephorite landing on the Howling Eye. Before you do aught else, I suggest you pay visit to the Aedilus Nest and have word with the Commander. He will be... Could you stop that? You are so annoying. Stop that. I'm sure as hell my he's thinking it a joke. He's bringing his blanket constantly. Constantly bringing his blanket. I just throw it back. Watching cutscenes and it will pay off. Yeah, that's 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 true. Below 70 mint, eye level crit. For a healer. I completely missed track of the convo. I'm sorry. Um, he will be able to tell you about the... Uh, said Ephorite, amongst other things. Make no mistake, the Lady of the Vortex will prove a formidable opponent. But I believe you can weather the storm. May the 12 keep you safe. Uh, okay, fine. You know what? Fine. Uh, not that one. This one. Black Shroud. Let's get the hard ones out of the way. I, I think Extreme is not going to be, like, unlocked uh, till later. I think. Is it actually going to, like, back-to-back -back once you're done hard mode... Uh, naval, then you get extreme. Now, mind you, we will not be doing extreme. Yeah, fuck. I'm not doing extreme today. Because it is, uh... That's just atrocious. We have the science. We're grateful for your aid. As you already know, the accused exile have summoned Garuda once more. If you bring that damn thing Right now, don't worry. Seriously, man, that dog's really pissing me off right now. I feel like uh, you know there's yo-yos. You know, we have to uh, we had like years ago. It's how I feel right now. I don't handle it very well. Uh, since her return, she has wasted no time unleashing her fury upon the region. Extensive damage has been reported to both Twelve Hood and Cortes. She must be stopped, and soon, less more lives will be lost. In the name of the uh, Elder Sitze, I humbly request you put an end to a for. Uh, 
As in the past, Garuda kept her court with the Howling Eye. This is perpetual protected again uh, by a Radiant Tempest. Fortunately, we have learned of an alternative way into her domain. The Exile have constructed an Etherite within uh, Natal, Natal, the stronghold in the central south of Cortes. This Etherite will take you to Garuda's Tempers realm. We owe this discovery to the Isgardians, who the Ed Elder Seedseer says desire to repay the kindness you showed them. For the sake of our people as well as theirs, may your mission be a success. What's that? Is that a hat? Oh, that's a weapon. I don't see it. It's a glove. So no, yeah, it's, it's glove. Okay, nice, nice. Is that what you get from like the Man Mandeville? After you beat Garuda Heart, you can unlock them. Draw them. Pew. Now, where the hell is that? Quarters over there. Um, can't go to the foundation yet. I wished. Let's queue up there. Why would I want that in front of my window? They glow. Interesting. Alright, let's uh... Let's fly. Draw sheet weapon. Oh, like so. Oh, never mind. Ooh, nice. Yeah, it is for a monk. I like that. Way to go. Looks nice. But prince, uh, uh, goddess. I, I keep wanting to say princess. It's goddess. Uh, how did you get your account stolen? Okay, guys. Oh, that sucks. Yeah, that would really suck. Okay, fine. We'll do it. <laughs> no, it, it matters not. It, it matters not what happened. Like, it happened. It, it just sucked. Let's take a look. Can I now go to the walking sand? What the fuck's going on now? My god, there are... Stop it. I don't know what's up with him. Like, he's been... He's not feeling well and all. Walking sand, of course walking sand, I can just... Never mind, here we go! Fun fact! Let's go! Alright, howling eye, hard mode. What the hell was a? Oh, I was looking at a butt.
skin is so crazy. Yeah, that was yeah actually yeah okay that was what we saw. Okay, then. Oh, she is so disturbed. Go. We'll get a bonus of 60 uh, poetics. And what will you do? What? What? Why did I get targeted? I'm be I'm behind these stones. Line of sight. Okay, we need to get those things out of the way. Something remind me of that. Uh, Let's heal Nadia. Someone is real. Who is standing there? Alright, now we need to go because otherwise it's, it's going to be quite annoying. Why me? Why me? What did I do to you, Garuda? Nothing. Is he having the thing again? Yeah, he did. Okay, my dogs are so annoying right now. Uh-oh, did we die? Focus on the boss. There we go. Easy as pie. I do feel sad. Okay, play a commendation, go a warrior, can't really do anything else, and we have loot. Um, greet. Greet. I should probably just do need for those. Basically, because I ran away. F17. Oh, oh, that that is not a fun story at all. Sorry to hear that. Right. Uh, what's the time? Because my dog is really annoying. Uh, all that remains how many stones. Oh, like so. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Makes sense, makes sense. Okay. I want to do a bit of MSQ before I need to stop. So, I will go and deliver this quest. Because I, I will end up with no tickets whatsoever. Well, I'm, I'm still, I'm, I'm glad that, that you, you got the game back and that you're playing it. I hope you're enjoying it as well. Like, that's the most thing. I, ever since I've been playing this game, I've been really enjoying myself. It's been so cool. Um, actually, we need to go in here. 
Titan, sp a Titan, no, I'll, I'll get it later, I'll get it later, we don't have to do it right now. Yeah, this ga the game is amazing, isn't it? And there's cool people, to yeah, it's true, I really am, I was so surprised by the community. I know some people have like, their reservations and all, I've been having the best time, just, you know, playing. It is good to see you hail and health and have received word from Ida and Papalino that you felt Good King Mughal the 12th. But I hoped to hear your version of the tale. What, what's the version of my tale then? So it is as they said, yeah. Summoned with the same method used by the beast tribes and taught by the Essians. Though unfortunately this incident did at least serve to remind the elder seeds here of our usefulness yeah that's that's true like there's no need for science if there is no primal to kill right her offer of additional support could not have come at a better time i thanks you know i kind of want to just get this one i know it's just like i think like three more M msq missions until we get to uh patch 2.2 the gifted, and we get uh, void blood, void sand blood. That's always nice. Owing in uh, to the tireless efforts of all concerned, we are at long last ready to bid farewell to Vesper Bay, so as to avoid drawing undue uh, undue attention. I shall make the journey to Reverend Stoll in small groups, departing at irregular intervals, lest you doubt. It is still my intention to conduct future operations openly, but on this particular occasion, we need to we the need for caution overrides all other concerns. To move north as one prounderous caravan would only serve to invite attack. By whom? It seems only right that I should be the last to leave, and I would have you remain with me until the end. Upon my departure, the walking sand will formally cease to be our headquarters and the premises will be given into the care of Oranger. I had thought to relinquish the property, but he was quite adamant and I had not the heart to disagree. And you have no spine whatsoever. These walls have bore witness to some of the brightest and darkest moments in our order's history. Mayhap it is best that we do not forsake them entirely. Uranger shall remain here and devote his energies to study the nature of primals. By the grace of the Twelve, he will one day discover the, a permanent solution that we have sought for for so long. Of course he will not be alone. Alicia shall continue to work closely with him as well. Who is Alicia again? Should they require our assistance, I, w I have their assurance they do not hesitate to contact us. Ruthless, very. Well, you know what's, all, what, what's also ruthless? My dyslexia and English. Ooh, that is ruthless. Oh, Alice Shea, of course, wait, she's here? Of course, yeah, but she, no, no, does she, she, she went to another direction, right? She didn't like how the science were operating, I felt like. Speaking of Uranger, would you inquire of him if any task... Oh my god, he's barking like crazy. Uh, the shed I'm building is also roofless. <laughs> First time I heard. Wait, you, you actually heard the bark? I think he, he he barked at the right moment. If I remember correctly, she is doing her own... Yeah, she is doing her own thing, so why would she be here? That's so weird. Anyway, I uh, would inquire and to ask one done. I cannot escape the feeling that I've forgotten something, something important. Um, guess it's nothing. <clears throat> 
should we just talk to Yustola just to get the mission? Like, we have all of the others right over here, right? Might as well fin close this up because I'm not doing it right now. Uh, the gifted. Okay, Yustola. There you go, man. Tight spot. So both Ifrit and Garuda are now vanquished by your hand. Truly, you have earned yourself a rest. Would that you had the luxury of time to enjoy it. It pains me to say that Titan has also returned, and with a vengeance. As was the case with his primal brethren, he is grown stronger and, uh, than he was before. When I went about my investigation, all ind indications suggested that the kobolds were nowhere near ready to resume the summoning right. Uh oh. But it turns out they were deceiving us. I should have known better. The kobold subterranean dom uh, domain runs deep, and they can easily hoard crystals with our uh, being none the wiser, and a vast hoard it must have been. Till now, Garuda was the most powerful amongst the three recent activity, uh, active primals, but according to our latest readings, Titan has usurped the honor. A primal's might is determined by two factors, the amount of crystals it had gorged upon and the fervor of its believers. I would like nothing more than to measure precisely how strong the Lord of Crag has become, but I fear the time for such prudence has run out. We have already received an official request for assistance from the Maelstrom. And as you might expect, it is addressed to you because I am on the call. For your previous encounters with Titan, you traveled to his. The Me. The Mizzen? The Mezzer. The Mezzen. By way of Ephraim, first discovered by the Company of Heroes. Sad to say, this Ephraim no longer seems to respond. But do not despair, for the Maelstrom has reported, uh, reportedly found another in its place. You will want to speak with Commander Rikia at the Maelstrom Command for details. I cannot stress this enough, but Titan has grown fearsome strong. So it see to it you spare no preparations. It is, it, it is Titan. Very much Titan. Art thou ever welcome, Une? But I require no assistance. Pray take thy leave, unburdened by concern of my well being. Verily, thy cons countenance, countenance bespeaks a desire to quit this place without further delay. Hmm. May have thou thinkest this chapter of our tale concluded, that these halls should rightfully, uh, rightly be consignated to the annals? Annals? History? Whatever. A man's eagerness to seize the future, how readily he doth set down the past. For many a proud pioneer had bravely stirred into great unknown, only to find there's, there the banners of his ancestors faded by the eons, and still man gloried in his discoveries. This though his pride that wisdom done ever given way to ignorance, while they who lurk in shadows remain hidden, Lost no sooner than they are found. <laughs> Second was right. Annals. Ah. I'm sorry. <laughs> oh man, this game. Seriously. I can't wait until they start doing MSQ stuff, Mike, more voiced. That saves me so much. <laughs> oh God. Be 
not offended Une. Thy conduct, thy conduct had ever been beyond reproach, despite thy surpassing strength and all thy many victories, thou hast never been so convinced of thy own greatness as to imagine thyself above the falling failings of thy forebearers. Mayhap it is the echo which hath opened thine eyes to the lessons of history, would that the same could be said of I should really watch that video, post that on Discord or something. Ah! When she came that cry, the solar twelves forfend the a dissident again, again. Uh, Une, you, you must get stuff for migraine. Uh, I think I should be able to see it, but you, the bot will probably, um, do something about it. Tell Louis Swar, would you have done the same? Tell me, Louis Swar, would you have done the same? Yeah, it, the dog is annoying, really, again. I don't know what's his problem. See, yep, yeah, can't, like, I, even I can't see it. All I see is three stars. He's going at a regular interval. No, 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 you didn't delete anything, it's the bot. The ball just, just immediately... You can whisper it to me, actually. I think you can whisper me. Uh, Louis Soir Levenure was a remarkable man, wise beyond mortal measure. Would that I have met him prior to his passing. Oh, dude in white. Nice. An Asian here. How? How readily you see, how readily you see, you are indeed gifted and dissident. But you, you are not like the others, your robes. Gifted but ignorant. Yet I shall not judge the, uh, you harshly. The fault lies with your forebearers. It has been millennia. Millennia. Yeah. <coughs> Mine are the robes of an emissary. Unlike he who came before, I have no quarrel with you. He who... You speak of Lalabrea? Lahabrea. Lahabrea is a warrior. He fought. He fell. He may yet learn from his mistakes. Then he, he is still... Come. I only confirm that which you already knew. There is no cessation, no oblivion, only expulsion. You, what are... Oh, wow. Seriously, she just walks in there like nothing is going on. We're ready when you are, my lady. If there is nothing else... Is something the matter? Oh, she can't see him. Ah. 
I feel the same way. After everything that's happened here, it feels strange to leave, but I'm sure we'll soon get used to Reverend Stoll. Well, I'd say I I'll let you say your goodbyes. Take as long as you like, my lady. We shall depart whenever you're ready. Okay. It is only to be expected. She lacks the gift and the knowledge both. To her, we are... Indestin? Indestic? I do not understand. Yeah, me neither. Shadowless, fleshless, formless. That uh, truth there is to each tale is deluded by time and telling. Knowledge dictates expectation and expectation calls perspection. Uh, per perpection? Does did she perceive not? So it is with all but a chosen few, even you when young, could not see with eyes unclouded. Why are they all talking like a Shakespeare character? You know nothing about me, nothing. Uh, yeah, I think it is. The gift grants you clarity. It grants you focus. With it, you may in time come to see us as we are, rather than a discrete approximation. La Brea did not think so highly of the Echo. Oh, in Japan they don't? It's kind of an old school idea on how RP... Wait. So in the Japanese version they talk differently then? Like... They just go all hipster. La Brea was wrong about a great many things. The Echo is indeed a gift, albeit one you have yet to master. And if we did... There would be no strife between our peoples. We would be of one mind. I leave as I came, in peace and dissident. May we meet again as friends. Wait. Stay where you are. What are you doing? What the... What the... Oh, that makes no sense. May I... I was... Indelicate? This a mercy she shields her children from his grace with such resolve. So they're from like the mother and they're like from the father or something? I don't know. Was it also by her hand that you survived the ardor, I wonder? It's always her, right? I take it there is no need to explain. Save your concern, he, he did no lasting harm. Whatever his intention was, it was not to kill. I'm glad you guys waited. I heard a cry, what happened? Are you alright? You look faint. Do you need to lie down? I could fetch you a flask of my special tonic. Is he just talking about alcohol? Yeah, just bring me the booze. Uranger sent word to the students of Baldastian. Tell them to scour the archives, the forbidden tomes in particular. If there's any reference to an escort robed in white, however obs oblique? Oblique? I would know of it. Anassian, my lady. Was that what gave you cause to cry out? I did moments ago glimpse a figure clad in white set forth from the walking sand. Yet Asians are wont to employ teleportation ma uh, magics. Why would one be so brazen? I do not care, uh, I, know, I know not and care not, find them, Une. Turn 
every stone in Vesper Bay if you have to. Is he standing to a, to a death trap? Pray attend me, Tataru. Okay. Let's go, uh, let's go warrior this time. Actually, yeah, I, I, I kind of want to finish this mission, but then I will definitely call it an end. There he is. That was easy. I still need to make a screenshot like for the... Uh... I am told that you are the warrior of light. But I would know for myself. I shall walk north and you may choose to follow. Know however that you will be way late if you do you may even perish would you survive we shall speak anon it's just just <clears throat> Japanese uses in all the dialect the English translation is a bit freestyled yeah, well, they sure as hell freestyled it. In the 1700s. Okay, let's get our buff up. I don't have a uh, 50 point yet, so I can't use uh, Inner Beast. Now I can. It didn't even come to my aid. Why is he sending me these, these fodder monsters? I'm being judged. Oh no. I still forgot to get myself a retainer. I should have done that. But uh, we were in queue, so I'm going to be giving that as my uh, excuse. Oh, here he is. Wait.
Man, these guys are absolutely nothing. I know I need to go after the Conjurer first, actually, but... Don't even bother. Okay. Say something funny. <clears throat> remarkable, truly remarkable. I give, uh, I thank you for granting me this indulgence. None saved, uh, none save see who b bested La Brea could endure such a examination. <clears throat> there we go. Finally. Have the laws of man grown so twisted in my absence that it is now permitted to lay hand upon an emissary? I bore witness to my... You bore witness to my audience with the antecedent, did you not? When you know I acted only... Then you know I acted only in self... He's right. He did actually only did... I realize the same cannot be said for La Labrea. Of La Habrea, not La Labrea. There's no double L-A in there. Even amongst his brethren, he is considered unique. Nevertheless, I cannot wholly condemn his mind, uh, misdeeds. For though... For though them we discovered you... For through them we discovered you... One so strong in the gift that she could cast us out. Ooh. And here I am, standing on my own. Your mother favors you still, that much is plain. But surely you must feel it. Her influence wanes. Her strength all soon be spent. These lands, these people, this world, all shall soon change. As it was, so shall it be again. As it should always have been. Doubt my claims and question my motives if you will. Only believe me when I say this. I am Elibus. Elidibus. 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 Emissary. Bearer of the word of the one true God. And we shall meet again. How oh, nice. He's constant. My god. He's constantly barking, so I'm trying not to talk as much. Alright, so this should just be a delivery, right? Thank the gods you have returned, Une. After you left, I began to worry that I might have sent you to your doom. I take it your visitor proved your I take it your visitor proved elusive. Okay. Beg pardon, he was waiting for you? What did you do? What did he say? As it was, so it shall be again? Of when does he speak, and of what exactly? The words of Elibus ported much, ported much, but revealed nothing, save perhaps a measure of disdain for La, for La Habrea. 
I had hoped for answers, but it seems I shall have to be content with a wealth of additional questions. There's actually one more mission uh, in this. So we could actually no, we cannot. Now I have to do this another time. I'm sorry. So thank you all so much for uh, joining me. Appreciate that, of course, the new follow as well. And um, I hope to be back. Well, playing the game, of course, but uh, play a uh, streaming Monday morning. It's going to be Monday morning, and then Tuesday night. And then Thursday in the midday. So yeah, that's for the next week. Anyways, thank you all and I'll see you next time. Have a good one.